Rosemary. In this video I'm going to um, give some tips on hand care using almond oil. As a holistic therapist I'm using my hands all the time doing my treatments and as a result my hands are my you know are the backbone really of my livelihood so I do try to get, take care of my hands. I'm going to talk about almond oil and the benefits of using almond oil on dry hands, also hands that are chapped, that are maybe a little bit cracked because of um, over doing the housework or over doing the gardening. But almond oil is excellent, it's rich in proteins, it's rich in vitamin E, it's really good to nourish the hands, nourish your skin on the hands. So my tip is a tip to be done at bedtime and what you can do is make sure your hands are clean, wash them in gentle, wash them in a gentle soap that's not going to irritate you because um, a pH balanced soap or a gentle soap will um, be, be easy on damaged hands and, and skin that might be sore or chapped. So, demonstration here. By the way, this is my bottle of almond oil. It's 300 millilitres and it cost me £1.79 from a local grocery store. Very cheap and it lasts for ages. I've had this bottle for a long time. So, I'm going to massage the almond oil into my hands. When people massage a cream or oil into the hands, this might be as far as they go. But a good thing to do, especially if you've got sore skin, dry skin, is to really work each finger individually by going up and down, some rotation marks, rotation movements rather, if you've got some sore spots. If it's, say, for example, a little bit of sore skin on a, on, a, on a certain area, work more to massage that in. Up and down every finger. Okay. It's a good move to do to make sure that the oil gets everywhere it's needed to go. Really, some good effluage. use a little bit more oil if your hands are particularly dry and there's some areas that you want to work some oil, some more oil into. Okay. I'm making sure each finger is coated with oil and just adding a little bit more. So remember you're doing this at night time just before you go to bed. What you use to stop the oil going over your bed sheets and to ensure that as much oil as possible soaks into the skin is to use some cosmetic gloves. These are cotton, pure 100% cotton gloves and you can find them in the beauty section of the pharmacy, local pharmacy or anywhere that sells um, well, most places that sell aids for the hair and for the hands, okay? So just one last attempt to ensure that the oil is on 100% of the skin on the hands. So, you put your cosmetic gloves on, and you sleep in them. When you wake up, I guarantee that your hands will be lovely and soft, or at the very least, a lot softer than they were the night before. This is a good 
technique to do if you if you if it's just a case of um, ensuring your hands are nice and supple the skin is nice and supple I would do it once a week if you've got particularly dry hands or some chapped areas or some sore skin on the hands I would recommend to do it two to three times a week and then you can slowly peter off the amounts of time according to the improvement in the skin in your hands okay so that's my tip on almond oil and hand care and thanks for watching